Welcome one and welcome all. This is Amoray. Joined today by Neri. Actually, where are Hello. you? Hello. Where is Neri? There's Neri. I'm here. And Hello. And Nio. Rock and stone. Yeah, as you notice, we're drawing something a little different today. It's, it's, it's something... Yeah, yes, thank you, Nio. Um, we're, we're, we're doing something a little different. We're in space today because... Why not? You know, we've been cooking a lot lately, so we're going to... So what's the, you know, polar opposite? Okay, we're going to be space dwarves. We're going to go mine stuff, and we're going to go kill a lot of aliens, because why not? This is Deep Rock Galactic, and uh, this is a game that some of you have actually requested us... Uh, I believe Nio's friends was requesting us to do. So, yeah, here we are. Our, our massive hey. audience of two dozen people. But, yeah, that, you know, we try. So... Deep Rock Galactic is a cooperative first-person shooter, and as I mentioned, you are dwarves in space. See, as you can see, space. Yes, very much in space. In a few moments, we'll be going down to an asteroid, attempting to mine stuff. Unfortunately, the inhabitants of the asteroid don't particularly like us mining stuff, and will try to murder us. So we murder them back. So, with that in mind, let's let's uh, let's go. So, what, what class is everyone today? No, what are you doing? I'm looking out the window. Yeah, you see, see that's you know, walk on the viewing. God damn it! Today I am the scout. Come I on, on, just because we're dwarves, we're gonna be civilized. Dwarves are awesome. Yeah, uh, I see you're rocking the dark iron dwarf look there. Except that you, you're uh, yeah. lacking lacking the fire in your eyes, but that's that's close enough. No, and I, I tend to rock the full power armored. In fact, I'll show you who I. You can't even, you know, first person. You can't even see what it looks like. There, there I am. See, look, look at that. Now that, that, that's a that's a dwarf you don't want to mess with. So I'll be playing for this mission anyway, the gunner. And three guesses what he does. He has big heavy guns. Now he'll be playing the scout. And the scout gets to move around really quickly and light up the cavern when he remembers to do so. And break my legs quite often. Very much so. There we go. No. Ah, where's no? He's in the pit. No, get out of the pit. I fell. You're like a child at a ball pit. <laughs> Nio is the... Oh, my God. Nio is the driller. The driller has a yes. flamethrower, demolition charges, and unsurprisingly drills. It's also my favorite class, but Nio is already the driller, so... Guess I'm not the driller. Yeah, I know. Oh. I'll, st I'll steal it back later. All right, so... Uh, as much as I'm sure you all want us to watch this fuck around for another 30 minutes, let let's actually go do the... Doing our weekly mission. Which is, oh, we're going to start off with a salvage operation. That is a good mission for everyone to get acquainted with. So, acquainted with. We'll, we'll, we'll just go us through. Yeah, we'll make it dangerous. Just playing with you guys. Um, playing with you two you Muppets is always dangerous. You, you can't go without beer. We can't go without beer. Now, interestingly enough, you know, some games you have different power-ups. But being dwarves, we got powered up by beer. Why'd you buy Dark Morkite? I not didn't. A I got, I got a, some Glyphid Slammer. That's also acceptable, right? So the different beers have different power-ups. Unfortunately, the beer on tap at the moment is Dark Morkite, which yeah. is for a mission we're not doing, but we'll have a drink anyway. And hopefully this doesn't make the oh. recording too terrible. Oh, oh. Good. oh, good lord, what is in this beer? Yeah, oh, I guess it. I guess this beer is very strong because I am drunk. Oh, wonderful. Yes, time okay. to go. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna drink the tea. People at home don't want to watch 30 minutes of double vision. <laughs> Wibble wobble vision. Yeah. Okay. Thankfully, there is a drink that'll get rid of all that. But, yeah. I'm going drunk. So. I, I, I apologize for the people at home. But here we go. There we go. Serving me up. There was actually an elven drink that will serve me. Yeah. There is also space elves apparently, but I think the people at home don't want to watch 30 minutes of double vision. So, I mean, I'd be happy with it, but you know. <laughs> you know how YouTube is these days. Everyone ready? Oh. Yes. All right, into the drop pod. Let's go. It is a rule that you have to cheer as you go to a mission. Of course, we're dwarves. Of course. The manliest of space creatures. I mean, there's no dragons, so, you know. This is yeah, the next I was best about thing. to say... The only way that this could Not be any yet. better if there would be space dragons or space kobolds. Uh, space kobolds wouldn't be as manly as dwarves. Well, there's yeah. space elves apparently because we have elf beer. And we're here. Let's get to work. Now I'm still up in the air if this video, this this game will be good to record. Now I insist it will be. I've got my reservations, but we'll see. 
My main concern being, you know, underground, it's a little bit dark, so I don't know how much people want to actually watch us fumbling around in the dark, especially when our scout forgets to um, light the area up. I've Which, already shot two. Well, congratulations. You're doing your job. So now that we're here, our, our, as you can see up the top right, we have two missions. One of them is the primary, one of them is the secondary. The primary mission is to find two little robots from a previous mining team that had a bit of ill fortune. Now, as you can see, this game's a little different to FPSs. It actually has a... I don't want to say Minecraft, but I can't really think of a better comparison. I think it's called Voxel or something like that. Sure. The terrain is very destructible. And since we're dwarves and we're manly dwarves, we all come with mining picks and we can all dig our way out. The driller actually has drills. And if the driller actually remembered that, we'd be halfway to we'll actually be through to the next cabin now. I'm drunk. Okay. Well, that's fair enough then. Um, right. <laughs> Moving on. So we haven't found any of our objectives yet, but, you know, a little bit of wandering around. We'll find something, hopefully. Mm, up there. We can mainly find other important minerals for us to mine. What are you two doing? I'm following now. Yeah, at least your first mistake. Yeah. I think I'm going to have to do a lot of editing on this one. <laughs> it almost looks like, ah, there's the tunnel. There you go. So we, the scout and the drill are the two people in charge of finding and drill. You have a drill. Please use it. Well, this early on, I don't know. Oh, my God. <laughs> I already want to set you on fire, and I can't because you're taking the class to set people on fire. All right, tell me to shoot. All right, this is what I do. Ah, I can't drill it because it's too close to the enemy. Out of the way, gentlemen. This is my job. Ah, goo bombers. Don't like those. They bomb goo. Who would have guessed? I oh, know. Uh, doctor. Where? Oh, yes. I heard a scream. So there's a huge assortment of bugs. We're not going to really... I, I think with this, people better off, you know, seeing them bugs firsthand. So guess what the grabber does? The grabber grabs people and flies off of them. We don't want that, so we shoot it. And now it's dead. Awesome. There's a separate side tunnel over here. Yeah. Uh, is, is it really important for me to come back? Um, I don't think so. Good job. Apocas. You've got it. I've got faith in you. Oh, right. oh, there's a, um, must be a nexus around because I'm just seeing little swarmers pop out. Alright, can you get, oh no, I was going to say, this would be a really good job for our driller, except our driller's off with the fairies, so. Chasing dreams. Uh, apocas, more likely. Yeah, well. Ooh, so, our secondary, our secondary objective for this mission is to find glowing flowers. Not the most dwarfly thing, but I don't know. Maybe they make beer out of them. Beer flowers. Yeah, you know, real, that's how you make them. I mean, gins literally comes from, damn, what's that flower called? Is it elder wormwood? flower. Ah, yeah, 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 elder, yeah. You're correct. Here, here's, a, here's a nexus and no, a... I'm, th I'm thinking of absinthe, that's oh. right. Get out of the way, scout. All right, since I, now, another thing I can do as a gunner is I can put shields down, which, um, shield things. You guys are the worst of... There we go. Right. So that unfortunate little ugly bastard ahead of us is uh, spawning enemies. We've also got another alien over there. No, that's a drop pod. Uh, that thing's spawning enemies. That thing is trying to kill us. Oh, no, well, never mind. See, this is what I'm worried about. I, I don't know if you're going to... You can't even see the thing that's trying to kill us right now. It's going to be nice and chaotic, though. Apparently, people like watching us fail, so... Wait, don't, don't, do don't, don't worry. You're gonna get plenty of that. In fact, I'm putting in that shield down because it's getting you too hit. A little too hot here. Now, thankfully, I have both health and a shield. And one of my dwarf's attributes that you actually get to decide is I get a little, I get health when I kill medium or big size bugs with my mining pick. Yes, I have that too. I think everyone does. It's actually a pretty good power. There we go. See. My dwarf is so manly, he heals his wounds based on how much pain he inflicts on others. I'm reloading, cover me for a sec. I love this yep. gun, but it takes like an hour to reload. Uh, okay. Did someone get the uh, spitballer up there that was lobbing crap at us? I did. I Good on you. I see, that's one of the flowers we need. Now what we need to do, this, we, we come back to this drop pod later. This is actually our ticket out of here, but unfortunately we can't leave yet. Because our... Um, Hyper 
capitalist mining corporation won't send a drop pod until we complete our objectives. I got some green oh. specs here. Oh, there's another Nexus. Shoot the Nexus. All right. Oh, these little bugs are driving me nuts. Thankfully, like every good sci-fi, the weak points are the eyes, the glowing eyes. That's just a real reality. Now, interestingly enough, dwarves don't have healing potions. Dwarves are... What the hell is going on? Watch my I back for a second. I'm, I'm trying to do good commentary here. Come on, guys. Right. Dwarves healed by eating rocks. Because why wouldn't they? A very This rock is called red sugar. It heals people. Don't ask me how. just does. Delicious. Uh, well, considering I have a full-face helmet on, I like to think I've got like a little blender that I just, you know, make a rock Grinds smoothie out of. Yep. See, there are different minerals that do different things. Certain rocks we can exchange for ammo. Some of them just give us more gold to spend on gubbins at the end. Um, trying to think of anything else. That, you know, the, the, oh, yeah. There's, oh, yes. Yeah, there's various uh, rare resources. Well, one of them's coming up right now. Oh, I was going to show people the meal, but someone's gone ahead and done it. Good job. That was no, I guess. Oh, now this is an unfortunate alien that likes grabbing you and murdering you on the ceiling, but we don't want that, so... A lot of little boogers. I don't know how good video this is going to make, but we'll find out. I get a feeling I'm going to have to do a lot of cuts, but we'll, we'll see how we go. Bring it, well, that was unfortunate. Oh, unfortunately, my um, my insides is on the outside, so I kind of need more um, health right now. Thankfully, my shield regenerates, but uh, my health does not. Unless I murder stuff. Oh, that's a Praetorian. That's a big bug. Unfortunately, when the big bug also explodes, it puts bat crap everywhere, and we don't want to stand in that. Acid it's blood. Great. It's acid, yes. Hey, look, yeah. Now, if our good. driller was actually bit. with the party, he'd up here, he could actually ignite that and get rid of it, but... Oh, okay. go, ow, 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 ow. Oh, fuck, I'm going down, probably. Yep. No. I'll get you. Yep. All right. Now, thankfully, uh, one of my other attributes is uh, when I run out of health, I actually stay alive for, I think, five to six seconds before falling over. And like every good FPS, the power of friendship revives you from any wounds, so, um... There you go. Thankfully, Neri friendship. with his, um... His, friendship uh, and booze. Friendship and booze, exactly. That sounds like a good title. Oh, oh, and that's what happens when an uh, grabber grabs you. No, yeah, while, not, while not immediately fatal, it uh, will try and fly you away from the party. Oh, thankfully, there's more red sugar. Unfortunately, I also just fell down a cliff, but that's all right. Into a spitballer. Wonderful. Let's wave. Oh. Okay. Well, I fell down another hole that wasn't illuminated, but that's all right. What <laughs> the devil am I? Okay, I'm going to be a little far. I'm going to be a little bit before I get back to you guys. This is going to... This is going to take a little bit. I think I plummeted about three stories down due to poorly illuminated areas. I blame my scout. I wasn't even there. You guys Exa oh, Exactly. Down. I've been downed. I get you. Okay. I'm not out of this yet. No, the good thing about the uh, gunner, the gunner can actually shoot little cables, and these cables let you, well, they let anyone in the party traverse otherwise inaccessible areas. Unfortunately, I only have a limited amount of them, but yeah. All right. Where are you, gentlemen? There you are. All right, now, the thing I was actually trying to show that... Oh my god, if I get one more bug hitting me while I'm trying to talk. Rude. Um, rude bugs. All right, so our mission is actually to repair and recover these. Take them back to the drop pod over there, and then fly away. There's quite a few stages to it, but... Oh, thank you whoever threw that leg. I'll demonstrate to the people. There you go, just slap the legs right on. Yep. Apparently dwarf technology is a lot like Lego. Or connects. <laughs> what a con... Uh, connects. A... I don't know. It sounds, it sounds, I'm probably going to show my age. I'm not sure what a connect is. They're more like... They're like a... More it's not like... Mono uh, okay. They had like little motors and stuff with. Oh, that's like the fancy rich kid Lego. Got it. Oh, yeah, God. pretty much. Oh, what was that called when I was a kid? Technic I never Lego. Had... Technics. That's the one. Yeah. I never had any of them. Oh, I don't think anyone did. <laughs> nope. I had the same bucket of Lego for about ten years. 
Me too. My mom still has it. I will retrieve it someday. All right, so we've got uh, both the mules repaired online. Now we are, we're gonna try and salvage the last couple glowy flowers. We, yeah. Five more. I feel less dwarfy just saying that, but you know. Let's see if we can find this real Hello. quick. Me right three. You're having the best couple. time of your life. Actually, oh, I've got four, right? I'm the best, oh, at, I'm yeah. the best at spacing, yeah. Space dwarfing. It's almost like my mic is kind of blocking the screen because of my really terribly ghetto setup, but that's all right. All right, drop pods up there. You know what? Let's um, walk into chumps. Oh wait, I no, I did that rather badly. Never mind. <laughs> Never you mind. It's almost like this area was very poorly lit. Is that, that's going to be my excuse for everything. I can't see. It's it's, it's too dark. Why? Why it's, did my flare not go into the wall? I don't know. Why didn't your flare go into the wall? It's a mystery for it's the gonna ages. Go the, it's going to go in the back of your head in a second. Oh, oh no. Hey, at least I'll be able to see where I'm fucking going then. That's behind you. Uh, I see what you did there. Uh, we haven't actually Bismol. called the... Oh, have we, we returned the... Ah, Abysmal. That is one of the rare minerals used for various weapon upgrades and the like. I'll get it. Oh, yep. You are kind of oh, the scout. There's a shit ton of nitro over there. Hey, you lit the area up. Good job. People at home can actually see it. Now, Nitra. Nitro is actually kind of a currency that we can only use during the mission. And it's exchange for ammo. Again, not sure how that works, but it just does. It just works, kind of like Bethesda games. It just works. Wow, no one, no one, no one jumped on that. Okay. I mean, yeah. Uh, uh, you you couldn't let me have this one, did you? Really, no? Personal space, come on. The dwarves here, civilized dwarves. Also, the fun thing about these, um, what are these called actually? These uh, ropes? Uh, zip lines? Zip lines? Zip lines, yes, sorry. Thank you. So, the funny thing about this is if you manage to fall and grab onto these ones, you don't actually take any fall damage whatsoever, no matter what sort of height. Yeah, you it, it's standard FPS grapple hook physics where yep. it, it, grappling in any direction or grabbing a rope in any direction cancels all inertia and momentum. Even Shall if it we... is downward. Why haven't we returned, uh, have we returned the... Shall we, are we ready? Oh, yeah. Right. Bugs. I assume, oh, okay. I assumed you'd already have. Alright. Now, what we're, now that we have the, the uh, our little robot buddies repaired, we will be uplinking to Mission Command, and who will hopefully, and, well, yes, always, Send us a um, various parts to repair the drop pod and escape in. So let's do that. Unfortunately, as we do that, a uh, whole lot of aliens will uh, try and murder us. So that's why we have guns, I guess. Yeah, I'll just let Mission Control explain everything, because you know what? Why should I provide valid commentary? There we go. Now, normally you have four people. We've got three because we're badass and. Um, don't really have a fourth person yet, so... Anyway! We're just elite dwarf team, we don't need a fourth. Famous last words. <laughs> we killed a uh, glyphid with the uh, resupplies. <laughs> oh, damn it, my shield's out of... Oh, okay, Do we need a resupply. Oh, you got it in a resupply? Yep. It's right here, yeah. Alright, thank god I'm completely out of shields. I probably should have done that before we started, but you know. Oh, I'm on fire every single night. Uh, I'm on fire. Well, that sounds about right. If you guys need a sh uh, I think we're up sh right at the moment. Probably don't need a shield generator. Kinda like those goo bombers. Bombers of goo. They go down like a helicopter. Yeah, unfortunately when they do crash they also put more goo everywhere. You got those little ones, there? I'll save my ammo. Yep. Oh yeah, I actually do have a little semi auto bat. Oh, burst fire. Pistol for sidearm. Oh, uh, I thought you were going with the bulldog. Actually, I am. I think I can get- No, this actually is the bulldog. Yeah, it's my- Oh, sorry. This is not- No, this is a four-shot, very heavy caliber revolver, which is actually really good. And yes, I like the bulldog. I went back to the bulldog. And I got grenades, because why not? Shield generator going down. I suggest standing in it. Shield generator is good, because not only does it block shots, it repels aliens, it also very quickly replenishes your shields. 
Fuel cells aren't coming. All right, so now that we've uplinked to mission control, they're sending some fuel cells for the drop pod. And the next part of the mission is fairly similar. Uh, we do have enough for another resupply if need be, so... Uh, we still have a charge on it. I might grab that if you don't mind, because I'm not yeah. doing great for shields and um, ammo. Do it. All right, now all right, that, uh, that feels better. Five, uh, over 500 rounds now. Heavy, heavy caliber explosive shells. That's... I also have access to other weapons as well, but uh, we'll show those off I'll, later. I'll call in earlier. Supply. Oh, fine. Well, let's be greedy. Why not? Unfortunately, we can't really take the nitro with us to another mission, so might as well spend it. Oh, that's a dude on ceiling. And he's dead. Good. Is that another one? Oh, that drop pod nearly hit me, I think. No, it's not going to hit me. on the ceiling. Can you see him? Got him. Good. That demolition charge sounds awfully close. It does. Yeah. Kind of like this grenade. Now what Nary's just thrown down there is a... What was it called? Static Slow field. Grenade. Yeah, essentially that uh, slow that doesn't actually damage the aliens, but it slows them down and uh, makes them take more damage, I believe. Uh, you oh, more damage from my machine pistols, yeah. No, I demonstrated the combustibility of certain aliens. Good job, no. No one's in the, or someone's on there. Get back in. Sorry. Uh, putting a shield down. I love these things. Now, Praetorians, um, um, if it wasn't painfully obvious, have a big weak point right in the back of them. Pretty much like any good FPS or any good sci-fi game, the uh, glowy part's the weak part. Oh dear. Oh, oh dear. We're not getting a little overwhelmed here. Unfortunately, Nye's blinding us with his neurotoxin. Uh, thankfully, the neurotoxin is designed not to hurt us. Only aliens. The downside is it's also highly flammable, and Nye has a flamethrower. I'm amazed no, I'm with... out of the flamethrower, so it's yeah. not good. Grab, grab some ammo then. It's right there. Oh, watch out for the grenade there. Well, you kind of walked into that. Don't blame me. Oh, I wanted to melee the Praetorian. Through a grenade explosion. Well, that's, again, bonus dwarfy no. points for that. Hey, grab has got a little bit of health left. I need to I'll reload. Him off the snipe. He's down. I can only imagine how this this video is going to come out. <laughs> it's chaotic as hell. Yeah. This is why we didn't record Hell Divers. This is still easy. Every every time I tried to explain something, it would just turn me into just yelling at something. Oh, oh my. That was some interesting ragdog flukes. Yeah, I shot him in the face of the sniper rifle. You Which kind of ra it. like pinballed him off the wall and over to us, yeah. yeah. Another grenade out. I think they've actually made cluster grenades out better now. They're actually worth throwing. I think cluster we're out of here. All right, that's it, gentlemen. Get in the boat, Dwarves, gentlemen. we are leaving. Good job, we so we completed both our primary and secondary objective. Go us. You get extra cash money for us. For we that. didn't even die. Not only that, but usually our missions um, count or give you some sort of uh, KPI or count towards earning KPIs, which can be used then to earn KPI points, which are then used to earn perks. That's a very long-winded way of saying doing stuff gives you points that you can spend on attributes. Yeah, well, yes. which I already I also, explained earlier, but that's all right. Yeah, but like um, secondary missions uh, usually are very good for that, and also okay. hazards that certain levels have. You're getting a little too technical for the people at home, but that's all right. There we go, perk <laughs> points. Doing stuff gives you perk points. Spend perk points to make well. But the thing is, I've already got all the attributes I want anyway, so meh. Unfortunately, we're kind of late game. I mean, this game's been out for a decent while now, and. Um, 
Play no, Mario. especially plays way too much of this game. So that's why he's, I don't know, triple promoted gold star. <laughs> I don't know. I'm only once promoted. Sadness. High king of space High rock. King of yeah, whatever. Space rock, yeah. Oh, what's my, hold on, what's my title? My title is officially Lord of the Deep. Wow, I didn't even know that. I, I was just guessing. But okay, Lord of the Deep. There we go. You heard it here, for, you heard it here folks, Lord. Yeah, Naya, Lord. Naya's Lord. We're all done. We, we actually found done. we actually found a game Naya was somewhat decent at. <laughs> well, that's a little bit of an insight into it today. Uh, hopefully that made it somewhat entertaining viewing. And um, yeah, we'll probably cut it here and um, maybe do another video. So let's give people a bit of a bit more of a sample of what this game has to offer. And if you want to see more, uh, yeah, leave us a comment and let us know. So, yeah, have a good one, folks. We'll see you next time. Rock and stone. Rock and roll. To the bone. That'll do. That'll do. <laughs>